you people that have been around here for two and three years, and even you people that are in your first year here. You know, I have long been a proponent and a strong believer of intangibles. Size and strength and speed does not get you to championships. Get your winning record, put you in the hunt every year. What takes you from the regular season into the quarterfinals, into the semifinals, and hopefully into the finals is not those physical characteristics, gentlemen, it's this. It's up there. I'm going to carry the good times that I've had with my teammates. Uh, I'm not going to forget course Coach Gordon. Uh, he's been a, he's helped me uh, in my life and all my other coaches have too. So it's going to be a, a good learning experience that I've come across and it's going to make me a better person. I definitely love being on the football team. You know, it's, just, it's just definitely a good thing to be on, be part of. So that's what I remember always. Well, I definitely want to go to college. I have no clue what college I want to go to or what I want to major in. I'm looking more so in business and psychology, but I haven't really found out exactly what I want to do yet. Go to college and say, I think I'm going to say communications. So I'm going to go to college. Uh, I'm looking at to maintain my grades and definitely go to college. I'm not sure which college yet, but I definitely plan on going to college after this year. Anything in particular you'd like to study? Um, maybe business or uh, computer engineering. I'm going to college. Of course I'm going to college. You know, I want to uh, try and make it to the NFL, hopefully have a good season in college. But if that don't happen, I'll try to go to college for my academics or something. But um, other than that, I'm going to college regardless. Going to college too, definitely. Hopefully I'll start stepping up and playing a little better like I know I could, making some more plays, but I'm definitely going to college. I mean, just being around the players all day, the coaches, and the locker room things we do uh, on the field, scout teams. I mean, I worked my hardest. I tried my hardest. Got two touchdowns, a couple yards on there. I tried, tried my hardest every day at practice. I mean, I make a joke here and there, but I'm coming to play. Definitely going to after post-secondary education, college. Um, I'm not so sure as to what which college. I'm very undecided on that. And you know, I'm def I definitely want to participate in either wrestling or football. And that's another question mark for me right now. So I'm pretty much just enjoying my senior year, as both academically and athletically. Well, I'm a once the season's over, I'm going to train hard, like once the get goes, so I can get into college. That's my main goal. And I'm not sure what I want to do afterwards, either computer programming or getting into business and finance. Well, uh, I plan on going to Virginia, hopefully, if I can get accepted for architecture, basically. And the uh, thing I'll take from Penn Hills is uh, learning how to lead, you know, Taking leadership, listening to people, just getting everything collectively together, listening to what other people have to say, and uh, just.
try to work together commonly. So that's what I'll take. Down to the end. Um, well, my plans for after high school is I'm going to go to college, and uh, you're going to see me on Saturdays playing football. And um, I'm just going to miss everything being here after my season season's over, being with my friends and just being with the team. You know, it's, it's, it's a great experience to be on a football team. I'm hoping to go some kind of college and uh, probably major in business or something. I mean, that's, that's what I'm planning on doing right now. I'm taking classes in school as of right now that can get me prepared for that. And so when I go to college, I already have a little bit of idea on what, I, what to be looking for, you know what I'm saying, and then go on with my life. Well, I've been thinking about going through computer programming and maybe try to get a job at Sony, go through that field. In college, I would like to go into architecture or into the trades and hopefully play football in college. Uh, take it one game at a time, uh, keep winning, get our respect. Hopefully, finally beat Woodland Hills because it's been something I've always been wanting. So uh, after that, you know, hopefully keep continue winning, get the whips in the uh, states. But after that, I want to go to college. I don't know where yet, and I want to study uh, elementary education. Yeah, it feels exactly like that. You know, yeah, I'm proud. I played. You know, I was there. You know. Mostly on my skills, you know, what I'm doing on defense, and hopefully if I get in college, I hopefully want to get to play on a football team, get to start, you know. Um, I think I want to take some teamwork, you know. Everything is better when you do teamwork. I think I want to take uh, hard work, you know, everything. We we, we uh, prepare for this so long, we only get to show our things about, like, 12 times, you know what I'm saying? Only get the show, so you know, I'm gonna take all that good times with my friends and everything. Me and Mike been in school together since we was like in fourth, third grade, something like that, you know, second grade. <laughs> I think just a uh, good work ethic that you know, you come off a season and two months later you're back in the weight room, you know, working out three days a week and just trying to get better for the next season. So, I think. One of the things that I'll take from this football high school experience is just a good work ethic. Well, uh, football is about the only thing we got time for right now. And uh, after high school, I plan on going to college. Uh, I don't know where I want to go yet. I want to stay somewhere local, though. I'm probably going to take something in business. High school, I plan to go to a four-year college. Um, hopefully, you'll see me playing football on Saturday. Um, right now, I don't know as education, like I don't know if I want to do uh, business or I want to do communications, because I want to I want to get something into broadcasting. But then also, my dad has a construction company that I could take over and run it. But uh, as far as that's concerned, I'm gonna have to wait till next year to see what I'm gonna do. Come closer, right there. Uh, hopefully you see big things out there. Hopefully starting all season, playing, doing good things. And after, hope to go to college, play football after um, high school. And I don't know what I want to major in or anything yet. So. Come on, there. Right there, hold it. Nice smile. Well, I hope to progress as the season goes on. And if nothing falls through this season, then I'll just try for track. And if nothing falls through for track, <laughs> then, you know, I'll just go to somewhere. <laughs> but I'm trying to push it through before uh, between track and football. The folks should be over.
over here. Go on over there and give them a kiss. Tell them how much you love them. They're going to introduce you. As soon as you get across, get your ass in there as fast as you can. Go ahead, guys. Let's go. Out. Each one of you suck it up and don't wait for the other guy to do it. You gotta do it. Personal commitment to yourself. Go out and make something happen tonight. Be somebody tonight. Each one of you have the power. Even the guys on the sidelines, you have the power to inspire somebody else. Go out and make it happen on your own. Don't wait. Larry Jackson in the middle. From New York, the greatest city in the world, it's The Late Show with David Letterman. Here's tonight's top ten list. Great drop, looks downfield, launch you on has. Harvey oh, at the 25 yard line, 10 5 touchdown, Penn Hill. David Harvey. Bummer. Looks to throw back under pressure. Four Indians. Is he going to be able to get the ball? No, he doesn't. Brought down back at the seven yard line. Butler would have done well to try to get rid of it, but he's sacked. Back at the seven yard line. That's a 15 yard loss for Butler. And it'll be third down and 24 for the Tigers. And Morelli's going to throw. Straight drop. Looks right side. Launches one down. Field for Harvey behind the defense. Harvey has it at the 35. Harvey inside the 20. 10 5. Touchdown, Penn Hills. Right launch throw the pass intercepted by the Indians. Intercepted at the 47 yard line, return across the 20. Inside the 10, corner of the end zone, touchdown, Penn Hills to Kendrick Robinson into the end zone for the Indian touchdown. Kelly gonna throw straight drop, sets up the screen. Looking for Lewis, has it at the 20. Lewis across the 30, has the blocks, 40. Lewis across midfield, Lewis. Looking for another block inside the 20, 10, 5, touchdown, Penn Hills! Well, he's going to throw. Nice play fake. Looking downfield for Harvey. Underneath, he has a man. Abdul at the 40 yard line. Abdul up the sideline. 20, 15, 10, 5, one man to be touchdown, Penn Hills! James Abdul underneath. And the Indians on the board once again. Aldridge again to throw, he's hit. There's the ball to the tournament, picked up. The Kendrick Robinson, he'll have a touchdown for the Indians. The Kendrick Robinson, 58 yards on the fumble return, and the Indians put this one away. Aldridge is going to throw, wrapped up in the backfield. Pass picked off! Touchdown, Damian Matichek! Step up and throw. Looks downfield. Has a man. Ferguson is there. Ferguson intercepts the football. Ferguson has the blockers up the sideline across the 50, 40. Ferguson inside the 30, 20. Cuts back. Inside down at the 15, 14 yard line. Mark Ferguson, the interception, a nifty return gives the Indians the first down 
at the 14 yard line with 2.55 to go. Yes. Oh, stewardess, my husband's very sick. Can you do something, please? Well, the doctor will be with you in just a moment. Uh, one thing, do you know what he had for dinner? Yes, of course. We both had fish. Why? Oh, it's nothing to be alarmed about. We'll be back to you very quickly. Dr. Rumick, Mr. Hammond ate fish, and Randy said there are five more cases, and they all had fish, too. Yeah, the co-pilot had fish. What did the navigator have? He had fish. All right. Now we know what we're up against. Every passenger on this plane who had fish for dinner will become violently ill in the next half hour. Just how serious is it, Doctor? Extremely serious. Starts with a slight fever, dryness of the throat. As the virus penetrates the red blood cells, the victim becomes dizzy because we experience an itchy a rash. From there, the poison goes to work on the central nervous system, causing severe muscle spasms, followed by the inevitable drooling. At this point, the entire digestive system collapses, accompanied by uncontrollable flatulence, until finally the poor bastard is reduced to a quivering, wasted piece of jelly. Boy, I'm time to get some maximum voice. Teach him how to play. So I would like to try to explain to you what's, a, what's occurred here in the last 24 hours. Uh, I know you've heard bits and pieces, it's been on the news and so forth. About midnight last night, our first person got sick. And since midnight last night, all the way down to maybe an hour or two ago, we've had approximately 62 people get the exact same thing, uh, including coaches and trainers, and, you know, it has skipped nobody. Thank you. 
<laughs> Why you gotta listen to that's me? That's hell week. This is hell week, <laughs> son. Oh, that's more than hell. Oh, dude. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got comic books? Anybody with a yellow mouthpiece, check it out! All right, let's talk about a couple things, all right? Even if this wouldn't have run through us the way it did, at this point in time in the week of camp, especially with the heat we had, you are going to feel drained. A normal Friday practice in a week of camp would be pretty normal practice in the morning and then walkthroughs in the afternoon and films and packing bags and all that kind of stuff. Blue 18! Everybody back up. Blue 18! Get out of there, Brady. shows in the A gap and obviously great if we reach that A gap and he'll come to see you. Alright, we gotta get on the ball again, Steve. The ball is Here we go. 
Got some people over there that represent a big time old Penn Hills rivalry and some barn burning uh, games. And between us, them and us, we probably have more championships than any other teams would ever hope to have in the Doug Cal history. <laughs> Dropped at the one. Justin King will finally pick it up. Looks for a seam up the middle, brought down at around the 12 yard line. Bonner in front of King. Ivy's going to throw pressure from behind. Hill has him and brought down by Mike Hill. Help on the play by the Indian Tom Label. Dave Harvey for Penn Hills. Kick low. Brought down at the 47 yard line. Seam on the right side. To is the Indians David Harvey. Up to the gun, goodbye, touchdown, Penn Hills. Ken Lewis from 16 yards up. That goes back to Morelli. Morelli does get the kick away. Nice, nice bounce for the Indians. Goes out of bounds inside the 10. Ivy on the delay, launches one downfield. Has a man, the Indians are there too. And the pass battled away. Tom Claiborne was there on the cover. Harvey end around, not fooled again, but he stays on his feet. Harvey inside Gator territory, first down Indians up the sideline. Harvey, a foot race inside the 20, out of bounds about the 15 yard line. High formation, Gators. This going to be king of the balls on the coast. The Indians come up with it. Ferguson, big hole left side. Ferguson, touchdown, Penn Hills. Mark. Gators do indeed keep it on the ground. Let's get 75 people going out in the second half. And all 75 of them back to stay around here and say, we did a good job, we have to ride out.
Lewis, near side, inside the 20, 15. Finally ran out of bounds at about the 12 yards. Lewis, up the gut, into the end zone, Penhill's touchdown. Lewis from six yards up. The Gators will be using him, and there he is, Bonner. Second man, King. Nowhere to go, brought down in the backfield. Nice play, Palermo. David Harvey back to receive the punch for Penn Hill. Sattler, the kick is blocked. Sattler falls on the ball back at the 25 yard line. Ivan, straight drop, looks, throws, has a man. The pass overthrown and intercepted by Claiborne. Ball's on the turf. Bumble on the play. And the Indians come up with it. recovers the fuck. Smith will keep it on the ground, near side. Justin Kulbaugh fumbles the football, the Indians pick it up and run it into the end zone. Barlack and Kulbaugh in the eye. Smith can roll, look, throw, the pass picked off. The Indians up the sideline goes to Kendrick Robinson. And that's your final score. The Penn Hills Indians 28 to Gateway Gators 3. Nice job tonight by Ken Lewis of the Penn Hills Indians. I think he came up just short of 100 yards on the Indians season opener. From beautiful Penn Hills, Pennsylvania tonight. Penn Hills Indians play host week two of the WTIAL season to the Mustangs from Plum High School. Renewing an old rivalry with Todd John for four years. I think it was back in 1998 the last time these two former Quad East Conference rivals have met. Of Riley on the center, Brady McMahon. Best at the end of the near side, and that's the way Lewis comes. Big hole, left side, across the 20, 10, 5, touchdown, Fred Hill! Again, remembering to throw in the pass, picked off by the Indians! The pass was intended for Keith Horner, and the pass was pulled in by Mark Ferguson. Now Morelli, he'll throw, straight drop, looks downfield, launch, you want has. Harvey at the 25-yard line, 10-5, touchdown, Pet Hill. David Harvey. This time, Plum will come with the draw. Tracy Wilburn is tackled back inside the 15 at the 14-yard line. Ben Lemmern moves up into the pocket, pressure. Goes down as the ball's on the turf. And the Indians come up with it at the 11-yard line. Lewis is head calling. Morelli's gonna throw. Look, launches one, far side, towards the end zone. Has Harvey, touchdown, Penn Hill! Issue across the 35. The Indians say they come up with it. The pass was completed to the 37. It looks like Tissue was separated from the football. And the Indians say they come up with it, but I don't see it. There's the official signal. The Indians keep it on the ground. Ken Lewis, right side, big hole up the sideline. Touchdown, Penn Hill. Holy cow! Morelli does a nice job to pull it in. The Mustangs were there. And Anthony Morelli looking for some room to run. Could have been sacked way back close to his own 40. Morelli does a nice job to get across midfield. Cannot make in week four or five these great signs up front. Next week, North Allegheny is going to give you about seven different fronts. You've got to be able to block them. Oh, you miss an A-gap on the belly. Ben Lumber, straight to run. Into the near side, has a man down, goes the pass, is picked off by the Indians. Across the 35, 30, still on his feet, inside the 25, 20, 10. Five, Claymore, touchdown, Penn Hill. High 
formation behind Morelli. Twins to the right. Herbie Lewis bobbles the sand off and he gets the lane inside the 20. 15 10. Touchdown, Penn Hill. Oh, my. Made up straight drop. Under pressure, rolls to his right. All he sees is red, and he needs to get him down at the 15. yards on the sack. And that's your final score, 55 to 20. The Mustangs will move on next week to take on the Franklin Regional Panthers. The Indians, a big matchup here on the NSN Sports Network. Next Friday night from Wexford, the second ranked Penn Hills Indians will take on the number three ranked North Allegheny Tigers. Your final score once again, Penn Hills 55 on Mustangs 20. I'm going to Thank you very much for watching and listening here on the NSN Sports Network. Careful by Mike White from last year, attributing uh, North Allegheny's win over Penn Hills in the uh, quarterfinals to a great halftime speech by North Allegheny's coach. They wanted to play, and they came out and played. Just start tune up for next week, John. Let's see if you're ready to play. Again, Ferguson alone back. It's Harvey. End around. Near side. Harvey has a lane across the 50. Gets a block. 45 40. Harvey up the sideline. 30. Knocked out of bounds at the North Allegheny 23 yard line. Collington. First man through. We'll have the Indian first down inside the five. Brought down at the three yard line, it looks like. And the Indians looking at a first and goal. Lewis into the pile, into the end zone, touchdown, Penn Hills. Morelli again throws, Abdullah. Out of bounds in Tiger territory at the 44 yard line. Picks up 12 on the play. Pass to the end of the near side. And it's going to be Lewis up the gut. Still on his feet, inside the 30, down to the 25, marking at the 24-yard line. It'll be close to a first down. I'm sure the Indians are looking at going for it here. 12-yard pickup for Lewis. Again, rally to throw. Pass complete to Abdullah. First down, Penn Hill. Indians first and goal. Lewis into the pile, into the end zone. Touchdown, Penn Hill. Ugly play that one, Mike Hill. Tigers, fourth and goal, five-yard line. Butler's going to roll. Loki throwing. Has a man in the end zone. Under pressure. He's going to tuck it under. Has some room to run. Throws it away. The pass was intercepted, but the Indian was out of bounds. Called an incomplete pass, and the Indians take over on downs at their own five-yard line. Collington up the middle. Collington will have the first down across the 20, brought down at the 24-yard line. Morelli will indeed throw, under pressure from behind, steps up into the pocket, launches one, has Harvey, pass completed to 30, 20, Harvey brought down at the 17-yard line. Butler hit as he got the football, Mike Hill is just reading the snap count. are coming, they get the kick away. Harvey, back pedal. Zone 42 yard line, fumbles the football, picks it up on a bounce across the 50. Harvey, across the 40, has a sideline 30, one man to beat 20, 15, 10, touchdown, Penn Hill! Harvey fumbles his own punt, picks it up on the bounce, and returns it 59 yards for the Penn Hills Indian touchdown. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna go over there and pump those kids up and he's my house. I mean, you know, I, I don't need to jump up and down the stream at all and go, hey, this is a big game, this and that, and this and that. This is a mental game. I mean, you gotta play a physical, this is a mental game. We don't have any questions, X's and O's wise. The problem is we gotta kick off defense, the first series and the second half is all important. You gotta stuff them, you gotta play well, don't let them get back into the game. Then all the adjustments they made at halftime, if they have to punt to us and take the ball down and score, then what are they going to do? Let's do this.
Back under pressure. Four Indians. Is he going to be able to get the ball? No, he doesn't. Brought down back at the seven yard line. Butler would have done well to try to get rid of it, but he's sacked back at the seven yard line. That's a 15 yard loss for Butler, and it'll be third down and 24 for the Tigers. Which is not letting these kids remember. North Allegheny, a dangerous team. The Indians, David Harvey pulls in the screen pass. Harvey inside the 10 5. Touchdown, Penn Hill. Oh, my! David Harvey, 40 yards from Morelli. Butler's going to throw a rolling look in, and he's going to be sacked. Butler sacked back close to midfield at the 48-yard line, loses nine on the play. The Indians were a coming. Indians keep it on the ground. Kenny Lewis looking for a lane across the 20. Lewis wrapped up, tossed out of bounds about the 25. High formation behind Morelli. Harvey, end around, trying to find a lane. Showing some speed across the 30, 35, 40. Harvey, up the sideline, in Tiger territory, still on his feet. Harvey brought down inside the 35. At the 31 yard line of the Tigers. Fast back coming in motion. Morelli, long snap count. Points to Abdullah, goes to him. Abdullah at the goal line, touchdown, Penn Hill. Nice catch, James Abdullah. High kick. Tigers let it bounce, the Indians will let it roll. Morelli punting from his goal line. Will go dead at the 38 yard line. That's a 63-yard punt for Morelli. The Indians will move on next week to Baldwin to take on the Fighting Highlanders as Quad East Conference play will get underway. That'll do it from here at Carl A. Newman Stadium in Wexford on the campus of North Allegheny High School. I'm Bill Navari. Great to have you along with us tonight. We'll see you Friday night in Baldwin. Once again, your final score, the Penn Hills Indians 35, the North Allegheny Tigers nothing here on the NSN Sports Network. I don't think you guys are mentally prepared to play this game. I don't know why. I hope I'm wrong. If you're too, you to go, right. if you're too stupid to realize the talent that this team has, then shame on you. No matter who you play in this conference, if you come out and you don't play well, you're going to get beat. This being a team that is more than capable of beating. Like I said before, the three, three weeks prior to this have been good weeks for us and a nice win and all that stuff. But the fellas, unfortunately, don't mean anything. Hopefully, it gave you some cockiness and confidence. And if that's what I'm seeing out of you, that's, that's all good and dandy because you need to be a little bit confident in your skill and your coffee and everything. But you need to be very disciplined, and that's what I'm concerned about. <laughs> Sacco in the eye, behind Zach Wild, the quarterback. Boston played, quarterback went the wrong direction, you would think. And coming up to make the sack on the play, the Indians' Tyrone Turner and Zach Wild loses the four they picked up on the first play, and it'll be third down and 10 for the Highlanders. Play action, Wild looking over the middle, has the pass, almost intercepted. At the goal line, nice play, Tommy Claiborne to break that one up and it'll bring up a fourth down for the Highlanders. Collington in front of Lewis in the eye. Morelli's gonna throw, looks over the middle, has a man, Festa across the 45. Down to Baldwin territory at the 42 yard line. 16 yard pickup. And a Penn Hills Indian first down. This time, Lewis into the line, hit it to first man across the 45, 30. Lewis down to the 26-yard line, another first down for the Indians. Lewis 
Now they come up on a Festa wide open across the middle. Morelli hits a touchdown, Penn Hills. Yes. They gave Festa the room. Morelli hit him for the touchdown, and the Indians go up six to three. Ayers motion will be tossed, sweep left. Ayers is going to throw back to the quarterback. Looking in. Oh, do the Indians come up with the interception? Yes, they do. Wild was separated from the football, and coming up with the interception was the Indians' Terrell Floyd. Morelli's going to throw. Straight drop. Looks over the middle. Has Festa. Festa holds it in at the 45 50. Festa. Takes Sacklers inside the Baldwin 45 to the 43 yard line. No, he doesn't. Morelli's going to throw. Straight drop. Here comes Baldwin. Looking Harvey across the 20, 15, 10. Harvey, five touchdown, Penn Hills. The amazing David Harvey from 22 yards out gets the Indians on the board once again. And Tom Claiborne. And speaking of the hammer, Sylvester Hanner, he comes in. Backo loses another one. Well, it's going to throw. Looks near side. Passes over the middle. The pass caught. Stuart Ayers fumbles the football, and the Indians are going to come up with it. The Indians come up with the fumble. Ayers had it inside the 30. Morelli's going to throw. Lewis will stay in a block. Morelli looking, looking. Has Prokopic downfield. Has him at the 20 yard line. Nice catch by Prokopic. Prokopic down to the 16 yard line. For Kopik's range. Kopik gets the kick up. It's definitely long enough. And it's most definitely good. You're right, we don't. They're going to be coming. Everybody's coming down, right? Everybody's coming down. And we're G blocking. So everybody, I mean, we're uh, blocking the backside guard. So everybody's going down, except the backside tackle. He's now reaching, helping to fill with that, uh, well, helping to fill, period. We will run that to the wide side. We will run that to the wide side of the field. Okay. We get the ball towards the right hash. We'll go rabbit. Okay. Uh, Ralph and, and David, get yourselves as spread out as you can. But James and Joe, I want you guys really wide. Get those guys out of it. Here comes Baldwin on the blitz. Morelli steps up in the block and throws one down. So has Festa behind the defense. Festa, 10, 5, touchdown, Penn Hills. No flags on the play. Festa, how did he get behind the Baldwin defense? Wow, it's going to roll. Mike Hill comes in for the sack. Hill drops him back at the 35-yard line. Ferguson, big hole up the gut, 30, 25. Down to the 23-yard line goes Ferguson. Well, he can take it himself, and he does. Does Morelli get into the end zone? Yes, he does. Anthony Morelli. Credited with a one-yard run, and the Indians on the board once again. Morelli now three touchdowns passing, one rushing. Kick away. Harvey watches it bounce over the 40. And he's going to do a nice job of letting it go. Harvey picks it up after Baldwin touches it. Harvey across the 50. That's a legal play. 40, 30, Harvey, 20, 15, 10. Touchdown, Penn Hills. Harvey, 60 yard punt return. The score tonight the Penn Hills Indians, 38. The Baldwin Fighting Highlanders, six. That'll do it for us here. I'm Bill Navari on the NSN Sports Network. He said to me pregame, he said, boy, you guys are playing really good defense. We play some of the other teams in the conference right now. I think you're the best defense that uh, um, I've seen. And I said, yeah, but uh, our offense isn't doing that well. Just to say that, he goes, yeah, you're not moving the ball real well on offense, but that'll come. Penalty 
flag will come in. Hemphill's going to throw the football down towards the end zone, and it's intercepted by the Indians. Down and in the end zone is Tommy Claiborne. There's a penalty flag back at the line of scrimmage. And Morelli's going to throw. Straight drop, looks right side. Launches one downfield for Harvey behind the defense. Harvey has it at the 35. Harvey inside the 20. 10, 5, touchdown, Penn Hills. Seventy-one yards. Joining us late, Mr. Wild and Wooly one. For Kopik's kickoff, short. Taken at the 19-yard line by the Hatfield Spartans, Brett Helmer. Spartans move left to right. Thompson's going to throw under pressure. Gets away from the first man, not the, yes he does get away from the second man, but not the third. Mike Hill comes up to, on the sack, back at the 22 yard line, loss of six on the play. And coming up quickly are the Hemfield Spartans to the line. Again, Gore this time he's wrapped up right at the line of scrimmage, coming up to make the tackle for the Indians. The Indian Sylvester Hanner. Thompson on the option. Coming up to make the tackle, Matt Palermo will drop Gordon for a loss of a yard, and the Indians will take over on downs. There's a hole there for Gordon, but Palermo will come flying up to make the tackle, and the Indians will take over with four minutes to go in quarter number one. The ball at their own 31-yard line. Pointed and Lewis in the eye behind Morelli. Abdullah splits to the far side. Prokopic near side. Morelli looks over the middle. Festa wide open. First down, Penn Hills. He'll get out just shy of midfield to the 47 yard line. 16 yard pickup for Festa. Morelli's going to throw. Straight drop. Looks. Abdullah will have it down at the 20 yard line. He'll have an Indian first down. Offensive line, Billy Johnson, Mike Hill, Brady McMahon. You'll see Jamar Martin in there. Tommy Hughes, Danny uh, Matichek gets in. And the Indians will have a first down and a touchdown. Kenny Lewis from 14 yards out. And the Indian defense is now starting to tee off. Collington. Up the middle, across the 30. Bulls his way across the 20, inside the 10. Down close to the five yard line. Collington was just carrying Spartans with him. He would not be denied. Goes for toss right. Ball is loose. It looks like the Indians have come up with it. The ball popped out of Gordon's hand and the Indians fall on it, I think. Terrell Herbert coming up with the fumble. Festa in motion, will be the end of the left. Abdullah steps off the line. He's the receiver on the far side of your screen. Harvey trying to find a hole. He'll have the first down. Harvey looking for the end zone. And Harvey gets it from 11 yards out. In motion to the near side is Justin Sefchuk. Thompson's going to throw under pressure. Steps up in the pocket, but brought down by Mike Hill. Mike Hill with the sack back at the 21 yard line. Mark Ferguson, lone setback behind Morelli, and it's Ferguson up the gut. Ferguson inside the 10-5 touchdown, Penn Hills. The Indians slip Ferguson in. And Ferguson rumbles for 23 yards. You're missing tackles. You're missing tackles. We should have some plays. We should have some big sacks. We're missing the tackles. You got to get better. And you are straight up at us. Who's the better, linebacker? Who's better back? He's going 80 for a touchdown. We figured we could slow it down a little bit, but we can't. We have to continue to move you guys because we can't sit still. You got to make tackles. Get in position. Continue to run through the man. They're doing, they're doing nothing that you don't know of. Nothing. You're prepared to make the time. And for Kopik, kickoff. We'll go into the end zone. No return. 
Harvey, split near side, Abdullah to your left, Fest to the end of the near side. Collington, big hole, left side, first down, inside the 30, Collington, inside the 20, a flag will come in on a face mask. Damian Matichek still in. Thompson's gonna throw. Under pressure from the Indians, and Thompson's gonna be sacked. Thompson's gonna be dropped back at the 40 yard lines, coming up to make this tackle. And the sack for the Indians was to Kendrick Robinson. Fourth quarter about to get underway. The Indians coming to the line. Morelli under center, I formation behind him. Indians go play action. Morelli rolls to his right, looks, launches one downfield. David Harvey wide open at the 15, 10, five touchdown, Penn Hills. Gordon will be dropped for a three yard loss by the Indian defense. Thompson does a nice job to pull the snap and tries to throw back screen. There it is. The pass complete to Adam Chatlos, but coming up, LaVon Wesley of the Indians. Set to play for a two yard loss. Brennan Harris coming up to make the tackle as well. Ibrahim. Excuse me, getting in is Rob Pryor. Pryor will get down to the 40 yard line and an Indian first down. The final score here at Andrew U. Haw Stadium. It's the Penn Hills Indians 38, the Hempfield Spartans 6 on the NSN Sports Network. Good hand, good hand. Come on, ball, ball, ball. This is their big day. They're still very much in the playoff hunt. The win today would solidify the playoff spot for them. This is a team that has a lot to play for. Again, four receivers set for Norwin. Bob's going to throw. Kopik wraps him up in the backfield and throws him to the turf at the 20 yard line. Morelli, straight drop. Indians coming out throwing tonight. Looking downfield. Has Harvey inside the 10. Harvey has the football. Harvey has a touchdown. David Harvey from 54 yards out. Ackerman in motion from the slot, and it's going to be Ackerman slipping on the turf. Perry will be wrapped up in the backfield. They were unable to get a block off for him. And Wheel of Bob, roll to his left, roll to his right, launch, throw, the pass, intercepted by the Indians. Intercepted at the 47 yard line, return across the 20. Inside the 10, corner of the end zone, touchdown, Penn Hills to Kendrick Robinson into the end zone for the Indian touchdown. Matichek in a nose guard, Perry into the line and Hill comes around to wrap up Perry. Hill and Steve Renfro on the tackle for the Indians, no gain on the play. Ackerman in front of the eye. Indians collapse the pocket quickly. Billy Johnson coming up to make the sack for the Indians, dropping Wheeler ball back inside the 32 yard line. Collington across the 50, getting a lane across the 40. Collington up the sideline. Finally ran out of bounds from behind at the 12 yard line. Collington again up the middle. Collington inside the 10 5 touchdown, Penn Hill. Collington finishes it from 17 yards out. And the Indians on the board again. Wheelabob under pressure from behind. I don't think he sees it coming, and there go the Indians. Wheelabob will be sacked back at the 10-yard line. 11-yard loss on the play, and it'll be a fourth down for the Indians. Mike Hill, Damian Matichek, Billy Johnson. Rally straight drop, looking. Has a man wide open. Touchdown, Penn Hills. Festa. 
was wide open and Morelli nails him. Here comes the Indians on a corner blitz and Wheel of Bob is sacked inside his 10 back at the eight yard line. It's a snap and he takes a safety. Pressure sets up the screen. There's Lewis at the 35. Lewis has a block. Lewis across the 50. 40. Almost broke it from the 40. 20 yard pickup on the screen play. Horman will have it at the 45. Morelli's going to throw. Here comes Norwin on the blitz. Morelli gets it away. Has Festa. Festa will go down at the 35 yard line. First down, Penn Hills. Morelli again throws underneath inside the 15. Five touchdown Penn Hills. Joe Prokopic from 22 yards out and the Indians on the board once again. I'm back from the outside, Anthony. Watch your hots now. That's, that's the only success they've had is bringing those, bringing those kids here and here, okay? And even bringing this kid with them and bringing them uh, here and here, okay? So if they're doing that, we got one, two, three, four, and they got one, two, three left. So it's a matter of finding who's open and getting it to them now, hot. And let me tell you, it's not going to probably have an impact on whether we're going to win or lose the game. But if teams that are scouting this film and scouting this game, and I'm sure they're all up there, if they're scouting and they see that you can't pick a hot, then you're going to see a diet of this for the rest of your life, okay? Morelli is going to throw, launching one towards Harvey, down the sideline. Harvey comes back to make the catch at the 32-yard line, ridden back at the 40. And he's keeping on the ground. Lewis, left side across the 30, 25-20. Lewis, 15, 10-5, touchdown, Penn Hill. Willabob under pressure. Willabob will be sacked back at the 18. Willabob fakes the end of run. Under pressure from Robinson. Robinson steps up and it's intercepted by the Indians. Prokopic returns it up to 30. 25 20. Prokopic up the sideline. 10 5. Touchdown, Penn Hills. Prokopic from 44 yards out gives the Indians. A 50-point lead. Willow Bob bobbles the snap. Willow Bob under pressure. Going to be sacked inside the 30-yard line. Back at the 29, coming up to make the play for the Indians. Rob Pryor, the senior. It's going to be Pryor. Pryor will have the first down once again. Mike going pressure from behind, and he goes down at the 35-yard line. Coming up with the sack, Aaron Talia Farrow. 10 yard loss on the play. And your final score 50 to 7. The Indian defense outstanding, holding the Norwin offense to minus two yards in half number one. But our player of the game, no question here, quarterback Anthony Morelli. 14 of 17, 272 yards, three touchdowns. Anthony Morelli is our player of the game. The Indians. Don't get up feeling, get yourself calm. We're gonna run through everything that we worked on this week. We're gonna go, and then listen, when we're in the huddle, you gotta help him out. Yeah, he ran the four last week, fine. The 50's totally different. Five, open up, can, and whoop up. Period. I'll just talk I ain't gonna do nothing. Play ball. Give him the across the 45 to the 46 yard line, second and four. And there goes the misdirection, not fooling anybody. A flag will come in. David Show with the football. Movement on the line. Officials do float, throw a flag, and Marcinka will go down in the backfield at the 29 yard line. The loss of four on the sack. Morelli. Keep it on the turf. Lewis trying to find a lane. Right side across the 30. 25 20. Lewis burst of speed down to the 12 yard line. Kopik in motion. Abdullah split to the left side. Lewis, touchdown, Penn Hills. Five yards out. Kenny Lewis into the end zone. 
and the Indians on the board. 6-0, 722 to go here first quarter. And for those of you keeping score at home, that's another Indian first down. Once again, they're in the eye formation. Marcinko's going to roll to his right, looking to throw, wrapped up and sacked in the backfield. Billy Johnson will bring him down at the 41-yard line. Loss of six on the play. Receiver each way for Marcinko. Marcinko, play action, looking. And there are the Indians wrapping him up. Terrell Floyd with the sack back at the 39-yard line. And Marcinko's going to throw. Rolls to his right to pass complete. Down to the 29-yard line. Chow holds on to the football, but he gets stuck. Sinko roll to his left. Floyd was in pursuit. And the ball is picked off by the Indians. Indians will have it at the 20-yard line. Was that Tommy Claiborne coming up with it? Or was it? It was Terrell Harbor. Struthers. Get across the 10, out to the 13-yard line. Pick up a six on the play. Marcinko will throw under pressure. Gets away from Matisic, but doesn't get away from the Indian Steve Renfro, who sacks him back at the 50-yard line. Morelli is going to throw. Straight drop. Sets up the screen. Looking for Lewis. Has it at the 20. Lewis across the 30. Has the blocks. 40. Lewis across midfield. Lewis. Looking for another block inside the 20, 10, 5, touchdown, Penn Hills! <laughs> 77 yard screen pass, and the Indians on the board once again. Marcinka will roll near side, looks downfield, launches one. The pass intercepted by the Indians. Palermo across the 40, trying to find a block up the sideline, Palermo. Written out of bounds inside the 30-yard line at the 29. Harvey. Harvey sets up at quarterback. Flag will come in. Harvey across the 20, inside the 10-5 touchdown, but I think it's what's coming back. It'll be Harvey in motion to the near side. Rally will indeed throw. Looking. Festa into the end zone. Touchdown, Penn Hills. Ralph Festa from 15 yards out. And the Indians on the board once again. With 12 people on the field, 10 people on the field. Missile line. And time out. And then missile lined again and drew, uh, brought back Harvey's touchdown. That's great. I've had teams that understood that it's time to go. And I've had other teams that didn't understand it was time to go. Collington in front of Lewis in the eye, and Morelli's going to come out throwing. Morelli looking downfield to Harvey. Harvey has it at the 20 yard line. Collington, big hole. Collington, touchdown, Penn Hill. Collington from seven yards out gets the Indians into the end zone once again. And again, Morelli will throw. Now Morelli will tuck it under and run. Morelli will have a first down for the Indians across the 30, written out of bounds at the 35 yard line. Morelli, play action. Steps in the pocket. Has a man wide open downfield, it's Harvey once again. Harvey waits for it. Pulls it in at the 20, 10, 5, touchdown, Penn Hills. Marcinko to throw, has a man downfield. It's a caught, intercepted. It's intercepted by the Indians, Kellen Hawkins. That was almost as good as a punt. The Indians will have it at their own 28 yard line. Herbert, we're rolling to the near side, naked bootleg. Herbert has a lane across the 30, 20. Herbert, down to the nine yard line. Morris, right side. Morris gets into the end zone for the Indian touchdown. In the first half, final play of the game. And it's gonna result in a sack and fumble.
So Carlos Burns comes up to sack on the sack on the final play. And now your final score is Penn Hills 48, Connellsville nothing. Indians really establishing uh, it's really a passing game, big play game tonight. Indians. I want to again want to thank you for giving us the opportunity to be here, to play this game we care so much about, with the people that we care so much about. We ask to watch over the young men for both teams so none may be seriously injured. And above all, it gives us the strength and courage to play the game the way we need to die. That's all we say. We made a season's worth of mistakes last year out here. Almost one year to date. You've been waiting one year to get this revenge. You've been waiting for the last 12 weeks to play a team that's going to challenge you. But we challenge you big time. Here's your opportunity to get that revenge. But you have to be meticulous in everything you do, gentlemen. You cannot accept mistakes. Be physical, be meticulous, and we'll be eight now. Nick Sandoval, Ruby Johnson, trying to find some running room. Nothing doing there. Mike Hill comes in to make a tackle for the Indians. Again, Sandoval comes in motion. It's going to be Johnson trying to find a lane. Nothing doing there. The Kendrick Robinson on the tackle for the Indians. Lewis trying to find a lane. Lewis across the 10. He'll have a first down. Lewis across the 20. Tries to find a block. Lewis. Finally brought down from behind in midfield, coming up to make the tackle, Jeff Deakins for the Vikings, but not until Lewis hits the 47-yard line for the Indians. Deakins with Jarvis will come in motion on the other side. And Johnson will be sacked back inside the 15 at the 14-yard line. Big Billy Johnson coming in to make the tackle. Harvey trying to find a lane across the 45-40. Harvey across the 30. The foot race inside the 20, 10, 5. Touchdown, Penn Hills. David Harvey, 52 yards and an Indian touchdown. Kopik's kick will go into the end zone. This one will be a touchback. The Vikings will start from their own 20. Back keeper near side. Doesn't fool the Indians. Harris on the top of the screen. Again, Jarvis and Johnson in the slot. That'll be Johnson in motion. Here he comes, trying the end around. Claiborne does a nice job to string him out and fighting off the block. Allows Palermo to come in and make the tackle with the 39 for no gain. David Harvey's 52 yard run in quarter number two. Only points so far in the game. McLean wrapped up by Hanner as soon as he got the football. McLean will lose two on the play. The Vikings bring on Adam Shuley and the field goal unit. Shuley trying a 43-yarder. The left-footed kicker. Kick is down and kick is up and it's blocked. The ball inside the 50. It's a live football. A host of Indians. And the Indians fall on it. Tyrone Turner falls on the football at the 38-yard line. Lewis again into the pile. Lewis out of the pile across the 20 inside the 15, down to the 11-yard line. 16-yard pickup for Lewis and another Indian first down. Prokopic will set it up. We'll have it teed up just inside the 30-yard line. Festa will hold. High snap. Kick is up. Looks like it was partially blocked. It has the distance, but it goes off to the left. How can you be in the game? Not in the game. You're still on the sidelines. Another thing here, guys, the tackle's getting down blocked on. You gotta fight through his head or roll back. You can't let him cave you down Don't here all the way. You, you, you're taking these blocks like you're supposed like we're in practice and we're walking through something. You can make that play front side, you need to do it. Here we go. Sandoval and Johnson. End zone. 
Felt's going to throw, and he's going to be hit from behind, and the ball's on the third. And Mike Hill falls on it for the Indian. Going to be in front of Lewis. Dula near side. Lewis trying to go to the right. Trying to see him across the 35. Lewis across the 40. Lewis is the foot race across midfield. And it's going to be a touchdown for the Indians. Lewis, 20, 10, into the end zone, and the Indians. Goes 75 yards in two plays. Jarvis in motion, near side. Johnson, hit in the backfield. Wrapped up, it goes down at the 30 yard line. Billy Johnson on the tackle. And Eugene, or Andrew Johnson will lose a yard. Ferguson, Ferguson across the 30, 35, Ferguson. Written down at the 41 yard line. Nice bit of running by Mark Ferguson. Morelli. Throwback screen. Has Collington. Collington across the 30 with a block. Wrapped up from behind. Close to the 40 yard line. Johnson. In the backfield by Mike Hill. going to throw. Throws back to ball. Batted in the air and it's intercepted by the Indians. Renfro at the 15. The ball's on the turf. Let's see if the Indians come up with it. And the Indians do. Renfro on the interception. And the Indians get the break they're looking for. They have the ball at the 13-yard line. Collington and Ferguson are split behind Morelli. That's to the end of the near side. Collington up the gut inside the five. Collington carries Vikings close to the goal line. He doesn't get in, but he has a first down. Morelli will keep it himself. Does he get into the end zone? He reaches ahead. And the officials say he gets in for one yard out. Low snap for Kopik gets the kick up. And we're tied at 21. Quarterback Johnson from the slot. Wrapped up by Palermo, he'll lose three. Back to the 36 yard line. Johnson. He's stuffed, it looks like he may not have it, but let's check the spot. And he will be short of the first down by about half a yard. McLean will go in motion. Moore's going to throw, sets up in the pocket, looks near side to pass. Intercepted by the Indians, Palermo up the sideline. A flag will come in at the 50-yard line. Palermo goes in for the touchdown. Let's check the call. I have a feeling they're going to call pass interference on Palermo. will step up and throw. Looks downfield, has a man. Ferguson is there. Ferguson intercepts the football. Ferguson. Has the blockers up the sideline across the 50, 40. Ferguson inside the 30, 20. Cuts back inside down at the 15, 14 yard line. Mark Ferguson, the interception, a nifty return gives the Indians the first down at the 14 yard line with 2.55 to go. Morelli in no hurry. Lewis inside the 10, 5, touchdown, Penn Hill. And Lewis from 13 yards out puts the Indians back on top. But the Indians come out of here with a win. An unbelievable ball game. The Indians scored 14 points in the fourth quarter. They trailed 21 to 14 coming into the final frame. <laughs>
And nothing doing there for Morgan. They'll give him the line of scrimmage. Wolverines in the slop. Selman's gonna throw. Launches one down towards the goal line. Has Monday in the end zone. The ball almost intercepted and batted away by Tommy Claiborne. That'll be incomplete. It'll be fourth down for the Wolverines, and I would guess they'll go for it. Short kick. Picked up at the 30. Ferguson across the 40. Spins ahead. Slides in at the 43-yard line. Lewis. Up to the 23. Monday and Fletcher back for the Wolverines. Woodland Hills almost blocks it, but Morelli gets a good one away. Fletcher at the 40. And he'll get out to the 46-yard line. Palermo with the tackle. Desovich up, Morgan deep in the eye. Morgan into the line, bounces off, and brought down back at the midfield stripe, making the tackle for the Indians with Steve Renfro. Morelli, another high kick. Morgan will pick it up and go down at the 49-yard line. Monday in motion to the right. There goes Morgan into the grass. Morgan to the outside. Ferguson wraps him up. The ball's on the field. The Indians have come up with it. Morgan got stripped of the football. In the Third and 15. Shuffle pass. Lewis has a lane. Sees lots of maroon and black, but Lewis will get out across the 30-yard line. Selman's going to throw. Roll to his right. Looks downfield. Has a man in the end zone. And the pass not able to be hauled in by Monday. Tom Claiborne on the coverage for the Indians. So Morelli will have Festa and Harvey to the near side. Abdullah and Prokopic to the left. Lewis to lone setback. And rain beginning to fall again. Morelli will be under pressure from behind. Rolls into the grass. Gets away from two tackles. Has a big lane up the sideline. Morelli should get rid of it, and he doesn't. Yes, he does. He pitches it ahead for Lewis. They won the first half, let's win the second half. If they win by 21, great. Okay, let's win the second half. Next from this point on, you're gonna be uh, uh, peaches and cream all the way and winning 21 nothing, things like that, you're wrong. Not exactly the way I want you to get it with diversity, but you got it, but it's on that farm. Yezovich, not to do it there. Morgan. And maybe to the seven. Long snap count. Morelli picks it up, tosses. Collington, left side. Collington tries to find a lane. Will get across the 45, 40. Collington will have the Indians another first down. Selman under center. Wolverines keep it on the ground. Ken Benzo. Lewis hit as he got the football in the backfield. Now Lewis trying to find a lane to the outside. Brenton. Brenton loses the football. Indians say they have it. And the Indians do indeed have it. Harvey's going to throw the football. Launches one. Don Field has Festa. And Festa can't hang on. Morelli gets the kick away. High. No one back. This one's going to roll into the end zone. No, the Indians will down it at the one-yard line. There's a fumble on the field. What else is new tonight? Looks like Woodland Hills has fallen on it. Oh, the Indians have come up with the football. Opening possession of the half for the Wolverines. Morelli's going to throw. Hit as he throws, launches one towards Harvey. And 
the pass, a bit underthrown. Incomplete, and the Indians will turn it over on downs to the Wolverines. Pats, yes, a bit back to punt for the Wolverines. High snap, the ball goes into the end zone. Yezovich will pick it up, fall on it. That'll be a safety. Ball on the turf, Morelli picks it up. He'll pitch to Kenny Lewis to the right side. Lewis gets a block. He'll get a first down at the 26 yard line. He'll pick up seven on the play. But that'll do it for the game. Your final score, the Woodland Hills Wolverines 27, the Penn Hills Indians two. The I like to have a safety free at times. If not, I'm gonna just bring more heat. Anybody, anybody any questions? Gentlemen, we need a pass rush. You can't get close, get your hands up. If you're vertically challenged, try to leap. Disrupt, get your hands in their face. Matt, check, I know you got a vertical about this high, but you gotta come on, put your hands up, man. Gentlemen, you understand, he's gonna throw in rhythm, get your hands in his face. Hannah, any questions? Right. If they're gonna revert consistently to that play inside, we're going to attack that seven and nine hole, or if we go the other way. Flynn, long count, keeps it on the ground, wrapped up in the backfield, going down. Back at the 20-yard line. Chris Sarnice with the carry. Sarnice on the pitch, right side. He'll get back to the line of scrimmage. Chris Sarnice, no gain. Abdul will split to the near side. Harvey's in the slot. Indians in the eye. That's Ferguson, DPI calling this. Harvey makes the end of Ron. Morelli will roll to his right. Has a man down. So it's Festa at the 35-yard line. Festa. Following the block of Collington, we'll get down to the 27-yard line. All right, formation. Ferguson drops the football. Is he recovered in the end zone? It appears that he does. Check the call. Yes, he does. Ferguson recovers his own fumble in the end zone, and it's a touchdown for the Indians. So, in the eye, in motion. Nathan Great. Blaine's going to throw. The pass batted down. Or did he lose the football? Morelli's going to throw. Nice play fake. Looking downfield for Harvey. Underneath, he has a man. Abdul at the 40 yard line. Abdul up the sideline. 20, 15, 10, 5. One man to be touchdown, Penn Hills. James Abdul underneath. Four receivers going each way. Playing straight drop under pressure. Rolls to his right. He's brought down at the 15 yard line. Michael Hill with the sack. Morelli, straight drop. Look, Harvey down the sideline, has a step, comes back under, has the ball at the 19-yard line, inside the 10, 5, down to the 2-yard line. It's going to be Collington looking to the outside, getting into the end zone, touchdown, Penn Hill. Lynch rolls to his right, under pressure. Gets away, finally sacked. Down at the 30, 38. High snap. Kick it down and it's blocked by the Indians. Indians will watch it roll out of bounds. Collington. Big hole left side across the 10. 20. Collington. Barrels across the 30-yard line, up the sideline, finally ran out of bounds at the 39-yard line. 31-yard pickup for Colley. Well, he's going to throw a straight drop. Look, launches one downfield, has Harvey inside the 30. Harvey, touchdown, Pitt Hill! Harvey, end around, near side, trying to find a block. He gets it across the 40. Harvey, 50, cutting back across the 40. 30. Valley brought down at the 26 yard line. Harvey on the end around. Morelli rolls to his right. Goes underneath. Has a man in the end zone. Is it caught? Best of touchdown, Penn Hill. Flint's going to throw. Here comes.
from the Indians. Flynn, throwing to nobody. Keep it on the ground, but going down in the backfield, Charlie Anderson of the Wildcats. He's off back at the 17, five yard loss on the play. Up back, Pryor, big hole up the middle, Pryor, still on his feet inside the 10, five, touchdown, Penn Hills. Rob Pryor, the 36 yard run in the Indians on the board once again. This should be one of the home playoffs. Hey, Coach, Oh, he's kicking. Oh, yeah, he's getting Wait, wait. Your stuff's off. Me! Aaron Taliaferro to do the kicking for the Indians. The up man, George Kyles. Low snap. Taliaferro will pick it up and take off with it. Taliaferro across the 30, 40. Taliaferro still on his feet. Taliaferro up the sideline. We'll have a first down for the Indians. Finally written down at the 27 yard line. Aaron Taliaferro making it happen for the Indians. Oh my, when it's your night, it's your night. Cremonese will punt from back at his own 20 yard line. Low snap, balls on the turf. Cremonese will get it up and take off with it via Alaira Taliaferro, but Cremonese will go down at the 31 yard line. Still primers in the slot. Speedster. It's gonna be Primer on the end of round. Primer. Across the 30, up the sideline, ridden out of bounds at the 24-yard line. Trope will indeed get playoffs. will be the final play of the game. And it ends on an exclamation point. David Harvey, a 61-yard pass from Anthony Morelli. That caps a two-play, 92-yard drive by the Indians. They're up 28 to nothing. Later in the second half, Ralph Festa's 17-yard pass from Anthony Morelli on a fourth down play puts the Indians there. Hey. <laughs> 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 turn to the outside. If he's back, Billy's going to take the inside man of the two, you're going to take the outside man of the two. Just get that, get your ass turned and get them out there. Again, we can ask those grandmas to take for us to win the game on offense. He didn't give me enough. Like I said, he said, get us a lead, we'll be fine. Well, that's what we did. We did. So I asked him again yesterday, what did he say? He said, get us a lead. All right? My goal to you is to get 24 points and I didn't win this game. Okay? 24 points. Hey, that's in the first half. Let's go! Let's go! Morelli. Gets the kick away. Dominic Dugan from his 46-yard line. Circles back. Finds a lane across the 50. Dugan hit Penn Hill's territory. Goes down at the 45-yard line. Coming up to make the tackle for the Indians was Tommy Hughes. Aldridge under center. That's Davis in motion to the right. He has the football. Palermo fights off a tackler and brings Davis down for a loss of a yard. Matt Palermo, Morelli's gonna throw over the middle, has Harvey across the 40 yard line. Harvey has a foot race across the 50. Cuts back, goes down 40 yard line of the Seneca Valley Raiders. First down, Penn Hills, biggest play of the night. David Harvey from Anthony Morelli. Davis on the pitch to the right, tries to find a lane. Davis across the 30. The ball's on the turf, and the Indians have come up with it. Lewis, lone setback. Morelli's going to throw. Sets up the screen. There's Lewis. Nice block on the play. Billy Johnson with a beautiful block. Sets Lewis free across the 50. Lewis has for Kopik as a blocker. Lewis inside the 10, down to the 8-yard line. Lewis, left side, Lewis inside the 10, five, touchdown, Penn Hills! What a dandy of a play by the Indians. What a dandy of a run by Lewis and the Indians. Up, six, nothing. Up from the 40, Dugan back inside his own 10 for Kopik. Long kickoff, this one will be brought out to the 20-yard line. 
Aldridge again to throw. Looks over the middle, pass picked off by Billy Johnson. Johnson inside the 20, goes down at the 16 yard line. Ken Lewis, inside the 20, inside the 10, five. Lewis touchdown, Penn Hill. An 18 yarder. If Aldridge throws, yes he will. Aldridge rolls to the near side, under pressure. Aldridge is hit in the backfield, it's sacked back close, close to the 40 yard line. They'll give him the 39, but it'll be a nine yard, excuse me, a, yeah, it will be a nine yard loss. Aldridge is gonna throw, looking. Aldridge is gonna take off, and he's gonna be sacked for a loss of a yard. You can <coughs> get yourself in a very, very, very good position by shutting them down in his first drive. There, you know what they're saying over there. Hey, we're getting the ball in the second half. Let's take it down and score. No panic, we'll be fine. If you shut them down in that first drive, and we can move the ball a little bit, then we're in good shape. Hey, right, one and a half steps, gentlemen. You got a half here and one more. Because I know it's nothing, nothing. You know damn well it's nothing, nothing. We had a great play by uh, uh, Kenny and a block by James and a run by David. That's what's got in there. You don't win football games if you get your ass kicked in the pits for one whole game. There goes Davis in motion, toss, Davis near side. Tries to find a hole, almost loses the football. A flag will come in. Valley, Seneca Valley offensive line set up in their own end zone. Lee goes into the line. The Indians are there waiting for him. Almost a mirror image of the start of the first half. Indians won it. Seneca Valley got it back. Attempted a field goal. For Kopik's 30 yarder is up and good. Button in motion right to left. Aldridge is going to throw. Here come the Indians. Aldridge gets away. Steps up in the pocket. He's going to be brought down for a sack. Davis comes in motion. Aldridge is going to throw. Steps into the pocket. Launches one downfield towards Dugan. Ferguson, the only man underneath and intercepts the football. It is do a nice job to break Ferguson free. They're gonna give him the forward progress up to the 29 yard line. Seneca Valley side of the field doesn't like to call Morelli's great drop, looks downfield. Has for Kopik at the 40 yard line for Kopik out of bounds. Morelli put it right where he needed to be for Kopik hold it in and the Indians are in Seneca Valley territory at the 35 yard line. He's gonna throw again. Steps in the pocket, launches one towards the end zone. Harvey, touchdown, Penn Hills! A flag back at the 41 yard line. Davis in motion near side. Aldridge on the pitch and the ball is loose. Picked up by the Indians, Matt Palermo! Palermo inside the 30, brought down at the 27 yard line! In motion, Davis. Aldridge is going to throw. Aldridge is sacked back inside the 20 yard line. Line drive kick. Harvey watches the bounce at the 45, picks it up at the 50. Harvey across the first contain. 40. Has the sideline. 30. Blockers in front. Harvey inside the 20, 15, down at the 13 yard line. Aldridge is going to step up and throw. Launches one downfield towards Dugan, who has it in midfield. The pass picked off by Tommy Claiborne, they're going to roll him down. Aldridge is going to throw, wrapped up in the backfield. Pass picked off, touchdown Damian Matichek! Aldridge again to throw, he's hit! There's the ball to the terminus, picked up! To Kendrick Robinson, he'll have a touchdown for the Indians. To Kendrick Robinson, 58 yards on the fumble return, and the Indians put this one away. 14-0 halftime lead for the Indians. Kenny Lewis, two touchdown runs. Seneca Valley unable to take advantage of opportunities 
there and they're going to give you 100% on every damn play. If you can't match their intensity level, fellas, I'm sorry to say, you're going down. And you're more physically uh, gifted than they are. You're going to have to match their intensity level. That's what you got to do. Morelli, looking, looking towards Harvey underneath it and just out of Harvey's reach. The line. Does it to kick away. Harvey watches it bounce, picks it up at the 24 yard line. Harvey. It's a nice return out to the 38 yard line. Victor's going to throw. Looks right. Throws. Has Lamb. The ball's on the turf, and they're going to roll it an incomplete pass. Victor. Let it bounce and go into the end zone. Smart play by Victor. Jacob. Sees a lot of Indians, and they're not Northfield. Festa in motion to the near side. He steps up beside Billy Johnson. Rally's going to throw. Straight drop. Looks downfield. Has Harvey. Harvey at midfield. Top. Pulls it in. Harvey will go down at the North Hills 47 yard line. Indians' deepest penetration of the night. Lewis has a hole across the 35 down to the 25. Across the 30 down to the 25. Jacobs. To the 10. Snap is bad. The kick is up. And the kick goes wide to the right. Be Lewis. Lewis will have the first down across the 30. Lewis brought down from behind at the 35 yard line, picks up 10. So we gotta be so we gotta be able to run the ball. What happened? What we go? We want red four, Anthony? Okay, what happened, Mike? Did you pull? Okay. Albert will come in motion to the near side. It'll be Rouse. Hit in the backfield and brought down for a loss. Coming up to make the tackle, the Indians Tyrone Turner. 6-14 to go here, third quarter. Kenny Lewis with a hold to the right side across the 15-20. Lewis, have a first down for the Indians across the 30-40. Lewis, out to the 45-yard line for the Indians. Line and a first down. Richter, keeping himself, will be brought down for a loss back at the 27. Sylvester Hanner comes up to drop Richter for a yard loss. He's in motion, Richter's gonna throw. Looking near side as Albert towards the end zone. Richter will be dropped at the 25 yard line. Richter stumbles. Roll to the near side. It'll be driven out of bounds at the 14 yard line. Matt Palermo again with the tackle. Ebert's kick. Collington. From the 13 yard line, Collington out across the 25 to the 26 yard line. 13 yard return for Collington. Morelli will throw. Looking underneath, has Harvey wide open across the middle. Harvey at midfield. Harvey gets a block across the 30, 45. Will go down at the 41 yard line. And Morelli's going to throw. Looks far side, pass, way overthrown. And the Indians will turn it over on downs. Short kickoff, taken at the 25 yard line. Ferguson across the 35, ridden down at the 36. Indians go, hurry up. Morelli, straight drops, gonna look downfield. Under pressure, we flushed out of the pocket. We will get away from the sack. Morelli lost one downfield. And the ball falls between Prokopic and Abdullah. But Morelli, nice job of avoiding the sack and getting the pass off. The Indians end the season at 10 and two, a successful season 
by any stretch of the imagination, but the Indians will be going home with an empty feeling. The Indians' only losses of this season, week nine at home to Woodland Hills, and now here in week 12 on the road